were just talking about films with Charlie, and now I'm joined by the Georgia Strait staff writer, Craig, who's going to talk about some exciting news about the Ocean Films Festival that's happening in Vancouver, right? Yes. Um, the Vancouver Festival of Ocean Films runs from June 3rd to the 5th, mm -hmm. and it helps to draw attention to issues about oceans, as well as to stimulate appreciation of um, water and, uh, and um, activities on the ocean. And it's divided into three nights, um, each with a different theme. The first night is Adventure Night, um, which uh, will feature some speakers who went on an expedition to cross the um, Northwest Passage solely by human power, wow. uh, which is pretty amazing. Yeah. Um, and then the second night is Surf Night, which will feature a film called Bella Vita. And it's about the developing surf culture in Italy, which I had never heard of, mm -hmm. um, and a lot of people haven't. Um, and apparently it's a lot more family-oriented, like friends-oriented, because um, Italy doesn't get the same kind of waves as, say, Hawaii or California, because they're in, in a sort of sheltered ocean environment. So it's much more relaxed. It's much more about the, f the enjoyment of the environment rather than the true sport, as in, like, um, in North America. Like the competition. Yeah, exactly, yeah. yeah. And then the last night is Environment Night, and that's drawing attention to some very serious issues regarding water. Mm -hmm. One is called, oh, sorry, one film that they'll be showing is called The Last Ocean, in which scientists are trying to save the Ross Sea in Antarctica. Um, they're trying to save it from um, industrial fishing, which will really um, affect the uh, delicate ecosystem there. Mm -hmm. And then there's a speaker um, from Burnaby, um, Mark Angelo, who's a very internationally respected um, water, uh, rivers advocate. And he's, go he's going to be speaking about his film, um, River Blue, in which he traveled around the world, particularly in India and China, to show how the jeans industry is actually destroying a lot of rivers um, with pollution um, because when genes are being manufactured, um, it involves a lot of heavy metals like lead and mercury, which in turn are um, flushed into rivers and it's destroying um, rivers like the Li and Pearl River in China. Oh, that's horrible. And yeah. um, the environmental issues don't even, they're not just about the rivers as well, but the people working there. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. so that's... Uh, that's a tough one. So I'm very excited to um, to to join the Ocean Film Festival and watch some of these films. And definitely the environmental ones are really eye openers, right? Yeah. Definitely. Mm -hmm. What are you most excited for? Um, well, I think all of them are quite interesting. Um, it's always interesting to find out about uh, about things that you've never heard of before, like for instance the Italian surf scene, um, but also the 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 Ross Sea uh, documentary sounds really good as well. Mm -hmm. And how long has this Ocean Film Festival been going on for? Uh, this is the fifth year they'll be running, so mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, thank you so much, Craig. Thank you. Thank you for watching today's Ocean Story. We'll see you next time.